friends how are you fine myself professor dr rajendra raghuvir deshpande would like to welcome you all in this very interesting video regarding the clinical examination yes tongue can help in diagnosis of many health conditions so this is my today's topic myself is professor dr rajendra raghuvir deshpande and i am double post graduate in ayurved that is md in ayurvedic medicine and md in ayurvedic physiology this is my website ayurvedicfriend.com this is my mail id and you can always contact me on the mail and whatsapp 9226810630 for my paid services online medical consultation online pharmacy consultation and on demand i also prepare the audio and video lectures for the students as well as for the doctors so i request all of you please subscribe my youtube channel yes tongue can diagnose your disease that is why the tongue examination is an important part in the clinical examination of patient you can observe the tongue color how is the tongue color then observe the tongue appearance so what color of the tongue can tell you if the color of the tongue is pink that is absolutely normal blue at the tip here blue at the tip it indicates that it, there is a less oxygen less oxygenation of your body that is cyanosis white patch indicates the oral thrush bright red color of the tongue indicates the glossitis or inflammation of the tongue and pale in color indicates the anemia that is the low hemoglobin now you have to observe the appearance of the tongue if the, your tongue if you find some person has a child has a thick coarse tongue it can indicate the cretinism okay cracked tongue if there are fissures it indicates also the inflammation of the tongue that is glossitis dry tongue indicates of course in the dehydration whenever there is a loose motions and the vomiting in the especially child and the in old people always tongue examination it gives you tongue and lip both can give the idea of the dehydration bald tongue without any what you can say the papillae then that is the anemic condition ulcers on the tongue indicates the glossitis abscess ulcers or maybe the malignancy now if there is a tumor then it can indicate the papilloma or the cancer of the tongue coating of the tongue it can indicate the bad oral hygiene or also the, it can be in the indigestion white coating of the tongue indicates the oral thrush central coating on the tongue indicates the typhoid fever so these are the very nice pictures this is abscess ulcer can you see over here i have made a arrow superficial painful ulcers it gives the severe pain it is not serious but our life becomes troublesome when it comes in contact with chilies hot or sour food so how you can treat these abscess ulcers local xylocaine or metronidazole creams are available and tablet bflex orally okay bald tongue can you see here no furrows are there so loss of papillae except this particular central part this is because of the vitamin b complex deficiency so you can give the injection and tablet bflex oral black coating this is due to the oral iron preparation some liquid iron tonics when the person consumes for a longer time it gives this particular black coating nothing to be worried about it's not at all a serious condition then deviation of tongue on the right side okay this is 12th cranial nerve palsy right half of the tongue can be seen as a atrophic smaller atrophic and smaller part geographic tongue this is called as a geographic tongue that some areas there are no papillae over here okay bald and smooth some areas overall this tongue is looking like a world map bald areas like different countries they are like a different america and germany and all these countries are there okay no clinical importance bald areas may change their position there is a printing mistake if you allow me i can just immediately rectify it so that further videos will not be have problem okay so bald tongue bald areas may change their positions then 
staining due to the pan eating habit here you can see the staining over here advice to stop eating pan with tobacco or the chuna there is additionally here you can see the aphthous ulcers okay pale this is pale and pigmented tongue and this is also the tongue pigmented but this is not pale this is pale and this is not pale tongue pallor is because of the anemia this black pigmentation is nothing clinical importance or significance these are irregular black brown pigmentation on the right side that means in this picture color of the tongue is pale only irregular pigmentation no clinical significance but you can check hemoglobin okay furred or fissured tongue deep fissures it's from the childhood pain no pain is there no pain less so it has also no clinical importance oral candidiasis can you see white coating which cannot be removed removed is not because of the indigestion this is candidiasis or the fungal infection leukoplakia pre cancer condition this white patch is very very dangerous you have to always check for this white patch uh, because this cannot be removed it bleeds and this is leukoplakia pre cancer condition tongue cancer can you see over here here also here also this is of course non tender but very hard at its boundaries and chronic in nature this is a tongue cancer respiratory central cyanosis cyanosis can be observed in the nails cyanosis can be observed in the tongue deoxygenation in, in deoxygenation is there in the blood so this is all about what you can say about tongue so tongue can give the idea about many health problems or the diseases so thank you very much for patience during and i wish all the best please subscribe my youtube channel and share and like all my these videos thank you once again take care and have a nice day ahead thank you very much bye bye thank you